Okay guys, this next tutorial is so short that we're just going to rush right through it and try to cram as many topics in here as we can because usually these guys are so small, they're usually together and pretty much everything I do anyway. Okie doke, so here is what we're going to do. First thing is first, I'm going to take this bloody avatar off and put something else on. Uh, angel. Literally, bloody. <laughs> Uh, let's see, angel. Where'd my clothes go? Okay, fine. All types. There we go. Alright, there we go. Take off this bloody avatar. Alright, now what are we gonna do? Alright, avatar switched. Mm, I don't know. There we go. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to do now? We're going to go and down a list of things we can extract in a tiny little tutorials. All right, how do you extract scripts? Well, the first thing you do is sit at your computer, put your hand on your mouse, stare at the screen, and wish really hard that somebody will figure out a way to do it. Because we can't at the moment. No viewer can extract scripts. Never have. Never can. Okay. Now that we're done with that part of the tutorial on how to extract scripts, we're going to go on to gestures. So sadly, with the change of the way things work here in Second Life now, we kind of sort of lost the ability to extract gestures. Rip. If you want to extract your gestures, you may have to use an older viewer, but from there it's like really a 98% fail rate. So, gestures are out now. They're no longer cool. Um, animations. Okay, so how do we extract animations? Animations can be extracted through three ways. Uh, one, inventory, so that you already have. So, I'm going to type in here and find an animation. Alright, so I got this dance that I found somewhere. Somebody gave me it at a sandbox. So, you play it in world and you see we have the ability to jam. Alright, so if you want to, you can just click on it and then we can hit save.anim. And I, I was told that the BVH has been repaired, but I'm scared to use it, so I'm just going to click it. And it worked! <laughs> so you can save it. Or if you want, we can re just push the button and re-upload it back into here. And as you can see, Groove is in the so then you can dance like that. So that's one of the three ways of getting it. Now you have the other way is what if somebody else is doing an animation that you want. Okay, so I'm going to slip her this avatar, I mean that animation, and we're going to open it up. Show. Accept. And dance a dance. So we got somebody over there shaking their butt. And you're like, damn, look at that butt go. I don't want to shake my butt like that. And you can, Spongebob. So what we're going to do is... Ah, that cat. What we're going to do is we're going to right click on our target and we're going to click on Avatar Animations. And you are going to see every animation that this person has done for as long as they've been standing nearby you. So you can just click on it and see which one that matches what you want. And once you find that one, you're just going to have to uh, copy to inventory, which will put a open it up inside your message and I'll put it in your temporary it's not in your um it's not in your inventory permanently it's temporary so it'll be like somewhere here in your local animation thing which means that once you sign off you lose all the animation so don't get comfortable with there save it to your desktop as possible so once it's opened up we can play it locally and you can see if you're doing the same dance as that person and then you do the same thing that you wanted to do like we did in the previous one and then just click re-upload if you want or if you want to back it up to here you can save it as an animation 10 which can be shortened if you take off the ATN and it'll be a dot anim um, dot anim and dot animation can be bulk uploaded into Second Life so it's great if you have a lot of files that you want to upload quickly without having to go through the BVH process and again you can do the BVH or if you don't want any of that you can just copy the UUID which I have never tried but you know it's the title of the dance there so that's your UUID um 
I think that's it. If there's couples, like the same thing, you would just select um, yourself and the other person and then do the same process. And that's how you do that. Now, what if you have something that is inside of maybe, I don't know, like an old AO or something, an item that has the... Um, the animation into there well let me tell you some things about that first first let's find an AO that we can jack for said purposes um, I know I have a dead freebie stuff gangster AO okay so let's just drop that one okay so when you go into edit you'll see that there are animations inside of the um, AO and your first instinct is to double click on them and then play it and make it work and oh snap they fixed that neat let me try that out somewhere else later on that used to crash the viewer you couldn't do that so let me see if it still works let me see uh re-upload animation Did it work? Well, I'll be a mermaid's clam. Look at that. Well, darling, that, that's... There you go. Learn something new. <laughs> okay. So, the next thing you could possibly do is that if you own it, you can go like this. Copy to your inventory. Some blah, blah, blue. Let it go. And then... Okay. So, we have all of these animations. And nobody wants to export all of those animations one at a time. So, we would just go to the folder. Right click on it. And then, no, it wouldn't be in recent. We would have to, like, in recent, click on recent, click show in main view. <sighs> gangsta. It was a gangsta. Gangsta. Ayo. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I guess. Then file, save as, go to our desktop. Okay, that's obviously not the folder that I'm looking for. Oh, I got objects. That's why it's animations. This is the one we want. Now save this. So it's going to save all of our animations that we need. Now we we'll go to our gangster AO and you'll see that all of them are in .anim. Um, hmm... I think the to the convert anim to BVH will still work on this. So you would just run it through that and that will convert the whole folder. I had to reset my computer so I don't think I have that anymore. Uh, I will have to look that up for you guys. But all you have to do is just run it through that program and you can do that. Or you can just leave them as is and you can import them back into Second Life um, in bulk with the viewer. So yeah. Yay. All right, so we got animations, we got this, we got that. We need sound. What do we do about sounds? Okay, sounds work like they have for, for all eternity. It sounds like never changing. So all we have to do is find something with sound. I think I have a sound file in here somewhere. Oh, yeah, duh, I have my uh, blatant cat box. It's the big ultra. All right, so this person, somebody sent to me, I'm like, why <laughs> why would you even all right um i have to take my headphones out so you guys can get the sound effects so somebody had this as a what do you call it griefing tool so you could just keep tapping that and ruin somebody's life like everybody look down at their screen to see if they're being notified um so what you want to do to get this file is you want to go here and you can just push re-upload the money i spend on you people let's see if that worked no it didn't all right so let's just open it and then we have it we can save it as a wave save it as an ong Play it locally. Mess with some people some more. <laughs> and then we just um, upload a sound. I think you could just skip that in the Discord wave. Oh! Alright, well, well, Mr. Viewer, how about 
an AUG. Okay, you know what? Wait, wait, we got you, we got you. We're going bulk. Yes, bulk AUG. Mm hmm. Hmm. Sure, take a while. Now, don't it? Here we go. Now, what? Did it come in? We can't do sounds no more. Booty. I thought that it, that was fixed. Guess it's not. Well, I'm not gonna give up. Give me one second. Let me see something. Stupid sounds throwing off my rhythm. <laughs> hey, let's see. What about that? How about can you come in? You know, I didn't even look up there to see if it took my money or not. Well, uh, I guess we can't do sounds no more either. Or it just hasn't been fixed yet. Alright, well, that's that then. I'm sorry, y'all. I thought we could. I feel like I'm going to one more try. <sighs> Well, we can't import it back in, but I wonder if we can play the sounds, which is the most important. I'm sure we after that we could just convert it to something else, like run it through a converter. Gangsta tutorial. Let's see. Oh, sorry, it's a cat. Okay. Yes, 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 I'll upload it. That's not the right sound, is it? You would think I would know what the Discord sound sounds like after all this time. Huh. Well, I guess we gotta fix that. I'm a little heartbroken here. I thought sound worked. Well, what else are the loser squad? Sound, uh, animations, uh, sound, animation, sound, animation, textures, tint. Let me look at the, the animation, gesture, sounds. Oh, that's everything then. Well, that's all that is for this tutorial. That's. Not a lot. I mean, the other one was like videos. Huh. Well, I guess that's that then. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm going to skadoop now because I think that's everything that we, you need to know about Hydra. What we can and can't do. Remember that this viewer is and still is in development. So what is broken right now and what can't be done may be able to do upon the next update. So hang in there and I hope that it helps you out and you'll be able to grab what you can and further your projects as you know far as you can with what we got. I'm sorry that things that didn't work don't work and I promise that we'll look into it and get it done as soon as we possibly can. Uh, but it may take a while. But in the meanwhile, you can still do a lot of things, and I hope that they really do help you with your projects. All right, yeah, I gotta go because you guys know I can't say goodbye. 
If you got questions, comments, and concerns, please put them inside of our Discord like you always do. And if you're planning on lecturing me about the morality of this whole organization and thing, uh, what did you call it? Organization and tutorial class, then please keep them to yourself. Let that be your secret. Hold it forever in your heart. This has been Zero the Tenth, and I had fun. I hope you guys did too. See you in our next class. Bye, y'all. Take care.